All right, everyone. I'm back from work, and we're picking up where I left off, deep in the dungeons of the Four Jewel uh, Dungeons and the Slime Wart. And might I say, Slime Wart, that is some impressive, impressive six-pack you have there. <laughs> if I might say so. And I'm a little cautious because I don't know where the traps are anymore. I just got hit with, uh, I think, one of them. Uh, was the last video. I believe I'm going to be hit by a few more of them. Oh, ho, ho, look at that! Interesting. That went on my map. I'm bringing it up to date. Oh, I didn't know if I mentioned it, but I do not have the last level, level 8, mapped out. Level 7 is going to be broken into several parts, and we're going to be going down into the level 8 depths several times, and then back up to level 7 um, to get the treasure chests. The only thing on level 8, the only treasure are the treasure chests, and they only contain uh, an individual pulsating jewel, each of them, which is one of the uh, guardian jewels we need. So, we're continuing, and uh, that's a fair amount of treasure. I could kill a few uh, mountain creatures and get that same amount. Hello, another uh, trap. Yes, I said still there. <coughs> so that just had a, a pickle and cheese sandwich. Absolutely delicious. Oh, I was being chased. All right, Raker Brute. Oh, looks like my Psycho Strength ended. And here. Oh, 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 a befuddle! Oh, it backfired! All right, I am now befuddled. I don't know if it, any of them have backfired on me before, but I will be unable to do anything until um, the befuddle spell ends on me, which will take about ten or so. Uh, oh, there we go. Cast it again. And it worked that time. All right, now I need to cast a Psycho Strength. And now I can fight this guy. There we go. That's more like it. It's actually really tough, wasn't it? All right, there we go. All done. All right, let's uh, climb down this hole here. There we go. Level six. So we have another. Oh, and this one's a little tricky. I think. I think if it's not this level, it's the level below this one. I think I go down and then up, and then down again. It's a bit. Uh... Oh. oh! 289 points of damage! Ugh! Alright, well, time to use a healing herb. Wow! How to use a healing herb in a dungeon. That's kind of uh, rare for me. Alright. Nothing on this passageway. Let's keep going. Ooh, yeah, I'm taking... Oh! A blue lion. Hello there. Those are some nice fingernails you have. I see them. You put a lot of work into them. Oh man, that really hurt. It's 60 points of damage it hit me for. Alright, there we go. Oh, look at that! Someone tried to get me. I think my maps no longer have a lot of traps on them. So I don't know when there'll be traps in my way from now on. Oh, hello there again, Slime Wart. Still have an impressive six... Oh, wow, you did as much damage to me as I did to you. And once again, that is a very, very um, rock-hard-looking uh, six-pack. Oh, no. No, 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 Dangler. I don't think so. We're just going to kill you outright. You're ugly and unwanted. Just like my uh, first girlfriend who uh, broke up with me. Alright, so, nothing down this way. Uh, let's take a look. No, nothing. <coughs> Another treasure chest. Let's get him. Very good. I guess I can completely understand why this uh, this exhibit was closed off. These creatures are tough. Look at all the treasure we've gotten, though. 12,666 bucks. That's pretty good. And heck, you could walk in, grab a treasure chest, and leave. Oh, no, but that, that would require a ruby coin, I guess, every single time you want to do that. And I guess that, that uh, those aren't as common. Oh. Why am I pausing? I do not know. Oh, I'm a little lost. Okay, we're going this way instead. Oh, I don't trust this. There's a vent. Alright, nothing in front of me. Let's keep going. Around the corner. Examine again. Oh, look at that! Another trap! Oh, there's a slime splotch. Oh, and this one wasn't written on my map, because I'm taking time to write it down. I should examine again, just to be safe. Am I doing it? No, I'm writing it down or something. Oh, oh, the treasure chest. That's right, this treasure chest wasn't on my map either. 611, not bad. All right. 
Oh, and another trap down this corridor. Lots of traps down this one, huh? Now let's keep going. What do we got around the corner? Another blue lion. You know, just kind of like Alberto, isn't it? With its mouth like that. Go on, a strange type of creature. It's meant to spit eggs. Like the second Marrow Brothers, which was actually a different game altogether. Oh, hello. Poison gas trap. What do we got? Oh! Lots of poison... Hello? Oh, you're still befuddled. <laughs> ah, sucks to be you, Dangler. Sucks to be you. Alright, killed it. Let's take a look. Um, lots of more traps. Another trap at the very edge. That's the, the trap hallway. What do we got down here? Ooh, I'm a little nervous, right? Nothing. And let's take a look. Another Dangler. Alright, well, we'll just blast into oblivion. <laughs> Poor Dangler. Time to bolt ya. Down you... Down you go. There's another one. Alright, we'll... We'll bolt this one, too. I should have probably used a kill flash. Uh, are you kidding me? There's a third Dangler here. Alright, we're not going to look at it. We're going to cast a Befuddle spell. There you go. And now you're paralyzed. And now we'll just uh, stab you with my arrows. Oh, look, my... My Psycho Strength ended again. We'll cast another one. I feel very strong. And now we'll just slaughter this thing. Oh, there we go. Uh, no, no more danglers, huh? You had enough? Have you? Treasure chest time. There we go. I think this next right will lead to the way down. We'll be back for that, because I think there's two more treasure chests. This one here. And then another one further down the passageway. I think it's in that... Oh, no, it's up ahead. And there's a life box, a health box, in that little a clove there. I think I think I go and look at it. Um, let's take a look and see if I do that. Do I? Yes, I do. There it is. Right There is one there. And now it's time to go down to level 7. And we'll be down here for this hallway, which is very quick and over fast. And then we're going back up to a circular area, and then back down again. Oh, nice treasure chest. Don't mind if I do. 322 gold, not bad. Right, let's keep going. What we got? Probably a trap. Yep. There's probably a trap around this corner, too. I think it's a trip trap. Yes, it is a trip trap. And we'll keep going. And the way up. I think a trap gets me right here. Boom! Look at that! Just like that! 257 points of damage. There's another trap right there. Ugh, that hurts so much. Alright, and now way down. And now this is the official level 7. I should be in a dead end like area, yep. And... Let's start moving down here. We're almost done with the video, about another minute, I think, or so. So, um... Oh, way down! Alright, let's take it! I think the first uh, pulsating jewel. There's a trap there. It wasn't on my map. All right. All right. Let's go down. Somewhere down here is a treasure chest on level eight, the final level of the dungeon. It will contain a pulsating jewel. We need all four of them before we leave this dungeon. Or we will have come down here for no reason. Open that box. Oh, nice. Whew, that was a lot of hit points restored. Almost mixed up with that trap. I. I tripped. Oh, open. Yeah, there's nothing there to open. Whoa! Well, look at that. There you are. The first pulsating jewel. A large pulsating jewel. All right, one down, three to go. Let's head back up to level seven and keep on going. We will find those other three jewels. And then make my way back up and out of here. Yeah, let's keep going. Time to climb up. Back to level 7. Oh, whoa, hello. Surprise! Let's cast a befuddle spell on you. There you go. Now we'll just uh, bolt you once. And I've only got a few more seconds left, so I'm going to uh, stop talking. Oh, giant slug. Uh, we'll stop talking uh, here, and I'll see you guys in the next video.